Hey guys, Mr. Rock here, and this is your last video for the week of your first week of distance learning. It is Friday, April 3rd, and we're gonna start off with your daily question. So remember to do this in your daily uh, question response form, and this is how I'm going to be tracking your attendance. So, uh, and you need to have it done by 2 p.m. So when you're done with this video, go right to your daily question response form, and uh, today's daily question is, I want you to choose one symbiotic relationship I want you to explain it and then also identify if organisms involved are being benefited or negatively affected. So choose one symbiotic relationship, explain it, or is it a plus plus, is it a plus minus for the organisms involved? So that's your daily question for today. Uh, I don't really have too much to say today except as of right now, you should have your first attempt on your C1 learning check you should have your short answer response submitted. So your C1 short answer response, that should be submitted. And as of right now, you should also have your ecology review done on a separate sheet of paper. And we're gonna be turning in all of the reviews when we come back to school. So um, those are the three things that you should have done right now. As far as future assignments, maybe you are a little slow with this during this first week, just the deadlines are going to be harder this time um, in the future weeks, only because we don't want this stuff to become an avalanche for you guys where it slowly starts to build up and you put the stuff off for a long period of time. So um, starting next week, your short answer responses and your learning checks are going to have hard deadlines and you need to get them done before the next day's class. So if we have class on Tuesday, you need to get your work done on Tuesday before Thursday. So Wednesday night at 11.59. So that's just a heads up with late work in the future. Um, really today, there's a Bozeman video on energy flow. So there's a difficult concept, gross primary production um, and net primary production. It's a difficult concept. So definitely want to check out that video and watch Bozeman explain it. And then you just need to take your C2 uh, communities and ecosystem notes. So that's really all I have for you today, guys. Enjoy your weekend, stay healthy, and I'll see you guys on Tuesday.